lot harder. Ooh. Oh, we're going into here things, go. but it's definitely a lot harder for the city players to get out here because it's a lot more east long end. Anyway, oh. losers finals. We got zero to none. PK Chris versus Stock Taker and Lightning. I've never seen Lightning before. Yeah, this combo is very evil from uh, Stock Taker and Lightning. They're going mm. Villager Isabel, and there is a lot of things that they could pocket. They could pocket Lightning McMurphy. Sorry, they park pocket Phantom. That's really gonna help them oh, uh, getting yeah, back yeah. to stage. Yeah. Um, Such a good team. <laughs> Villager Isabel. What do you know about <laughs> Lightning? Because I've never heard of him. Um, I only played against him in dubs, and he was pretty good. Um. I don't really know much else than that. All right, so <laughs> uh, I'll, I'll have to I'll have to go up to him later and uh, find out because he's probably if he's teaming with Stock and you know putting in the effort, he might uh, go further into bracket. I might have to talk yeah. about him in singles. Um, zero to none and PK Chris on the other hand did pretty good at let's make moves. Uh, oh yeah, holding down the fort, Ooh. taking it over Larry Lur and Void. Really? Yeah. Oh wow, let's go Long Island and City. <laughs> yeah, hell yeah. Um, all right, PK Chris. Wait, what did he? Wait, what did he do his PK Thunder off of? I Good didn't. Question. I didn't see. I was seeing him recover. I might have to watch that later. Yeah. Um. Anyway, so it looks like uh, Zero is the only one lacking a stock here, but uh, he's going to take the one off of Stock Taker there. Yeah, PK Chris is doing a nice job of just staying alive right now. He's at 146. Mm, dropped a little combo in the corner there, but it is all good. Both of them now pressuring Stock Taker. They got a kill on Lightning as well. PK Chris staying alive just on the, the by the skin of his teeth. Is that the yeah. expression? <laughs> I can't think of yeah. it. Yeah, I feel like as long as PK Chris is going to be able to hold center stage, I feel like the weakness of um, Stock and Lightning's uh, team combo is that they have trouble killing unless they kind of get you on the ledge. Mm. But when they do oh, get you on the, the ledge, back throw. when they do get you on the ledge, though, their ledge trapping is going to be absolutely insane. Like one person can cover low with slingshot, and then the other person can cover high. And they also have the tree and the uh, uh, Isabel rocket oh, yeah, as the well. Mine, yeah. It's going to be absolutely insane. But this is a pretty big stage, so they're not going to be off stage as much for them to uh, take advantage of that. But they are uh, coming back a bit, uh, putting on some damage. PK Chris though staying without getting hit at all. The, he tries to get rid of that mine. He gets a hit a little bit, but the full mine did not go through. He's got lightning in the corner, but lightning's going to get out. And the, uh, what is Zelda's fire thing called? <laughs> Din's fire, I think? Oh, yeah, Din's fire. Yeah. I was thinking it was like Ooh, Din's love, I guess. But Din's yeah. love? <laughs> Cause, like, cause, I, I'm not feeling uh, any love from Nero's that, dude. Love. I do not feel any love from that. <laughs> <laughs> uh, so Zero Tanon going to take Stock Taker's stock, and PK Chris going to take Lightning's. They've got now a two-stock lead, which is super good, especially now that Lightning and Stock Taker on their last stocks. But yeah, PK Chris is playing really phenomenal. Uh, Zero Tanon actually holding on to the stock pretty yeah. well, barely taking anything there. They are on the ledge, though. It's going to be really tough. Ooh, Ooh PK, PK Chris going to go through the uh, the bowling ball with his yeah. thunder. Really smart passing there. Zero to none, able to get back to center stage. That's huge. They were in a really scary spot. <laughs> what oh. happened there? Um. Oh, I think that was uh, like a back air or something. <laughs> yeah, he like dared him into a back air. Ooh, oh, OK. The, right. the, the gyro, gyroid uh, saved him. Yeah, yeah. Oh, and Bumble the back throw, that's going to be it. So now it's just Stock Taker, one away from 69, literally 0.1% from 69. Yeah. PK Chris just chilling in the corner. Yeah, he's like, you handle it. <laughs> Zero to none do the dirty work. <laughs> oh, okay. Ooh, into the back air. Yeah, they're really good at comboing with their moons. It's pretty impressive. <laughs> he's just taunting in the corner. <laughs> Ooh, down smash, not going to come. All right, the down air, though, going to help Stock Taker get back here. Chris just sitting at the ledge, but the teleport going oh. to hit him out, and the Phantom to finish things off off stage. So, Zero to none, PK nice. Chris. Nice, PK Chris. What happened? Is he, gonna... Is he having an allergy attack? I have no idea what happened. I don't know. Huh. All right, but uh, they're going to take that first game. Mm -hmm. We're going to Town City. I'm surprised they're going to another big stage. Yeah, I feel like... I the... mean, to be fair, they are pretty abusable off stage. If, if they're able to hold on to that... Um... If they're able to gain stage control and sort of push them out, they have a lot of room to sort of deal with that and, you know, use their projectiles. Yeah. So I think the big stage does help them a bit. And, uh, the lack of platforms might as well. Uh, Lightning looking oh, to change, totally but Stock Taker definitely switching to Poly. Yeah, they're totally switching up this team. Mm. Looks like Lightning's thinking of staying, though. But we're Lightning seeing the would Pichu. be very fitting for Pichu. No, that's Did Stock Taker shave? Yeah, he did. Okay. Yeah, oh, no, I saw that I'm like... I think he shaved, but at the same time, I don't remember him having a beard. <laughs> yeah. It's sort of weird. Yeah. No, I get you. 
If he did, though, they, they would be rocking some nice beards together. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, facts, him and yeah. Lightning. <laughs> uh, but oh, we're going to see the banjo, yeah. Ooh, very interesting. And now we're going to town and city. So the big stage, making sense a little bit more. We got banjo to, you know, sort of... Uh, I don't know. <laughs> I started out by saying makes sense, but I have no idea why. <laughs> I feel like Banjo is pretty good in dubs. He's going to be putting out a lot of hitboxes. Oh, it's also tough to keep track of Wonder Wing. Because there's so much going That's on. true. Yeah, Banjo yeah. seems pretty good in dubs. And like, if you're in a 1v1 situation, like you're ready to react to Wonder Wing at certain percents. But in dubs, I mean, it's really tough to keep track of both things. Yeah. I'm also... Uh Banjo, he's got all those uh, aerials and stuff that are very safe on Rift Punish. He's got those yeah. big disjointed tilts. Um, and it's really good for taking stocks early. He's going to Wonder Wing, uh, going to get out of there. I don't know if he was trying to hit something with it, but uh, PK Chris yeah. ready for that. Good shield. Gets the jab uh, as. Jab. No, he got the forward smash. <laughs> very different moves. <laughs> oh my god. I'm sorry. This is my, my, uh, like, my second time commentating dubs. This is my first time yeah. commentating dubs. It's very fun. Not used to it. Ooh, I know a lot of times at Aeon, they don't even have people commentating dubs. Ooh! Ooh. That's the oh, double no, kill. He oh, he's at oh, he, tried to, he tried to <laughs> save him. Uh, zero to none. Oh, yeah. Yeah, he was ready for that, but like he just... That was really I sick. don't think Zelda really has the tools as much to be able to save him there. Yeah, I feel like all he can really do is like... I mean, if he goes for the back air, he's, he's going to get the sweet spot, and that's going to be untackable. Ooh, P.K. Chris almost getting the dare there off the edge. Who goes hurt again. Yeah, not going to work out that time. The Wonder Wing's going to hit him there. That's a really good punish option for um, punishing PK Chris. PK Chris. Oh, he's going to get Stock yeah. Taker with it that Ooh. time. <laughs> he goes for the dare, and Zero to None's just ready to parry it. Oh, man. That's how you know people, like, team together. Yeah. They, they, like, they have they, good synergy. They understand when the other's going to attack a lot. Yeah. It's also how you know someone's good at dubs. Yeah. They're just always <laughs> shielding. Yeah. Oh, stock taker all by himself. No, he's gonna be. Yeah, he's doing a really pretty tough. good job actually. But uh, yeah. oh, now he's, now in he's the on corner. the corner. Oh, good recovery. Very smart. He's been doing that a lot to kind of just get out of the uh, situation. That was also smart from Chris. He just went in and shield. Oh, the platform down. <laughs> <laughs> the platform moving away. That was yeah, that was pretty was dumb. Something. You know what? This is where oh, I'm gonna, gonna take the though. opportunity to say uh, ban ban Poly uh, not Poly <laughs> ban town. Yes, I'm ban sure town so and get, bring in Unova. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, that's gonna. All do right, it. so yeah, that's going to be game two losers finals as a best of five. Uh, oh, Chris is leaving again. I think it's it. It's got to no. They're getting up. Oh, okay. All right, so that yeah, <laughs> uh, quick two zero from zero to nine and PK Chris, and they're gonna move yeah, on we'll play to it. play. Uh, uh, Benny and Jewel. No, I could take a look. I don't know who was in bracket. It is Benny and Jewel. I was right. Cool. They're going to be playing Venya Jewel in Grand Finals. Who uh, cool. who did they beat at? Let's make big moves. I, no, sorry. <laughs> Other Greninja. Uh, Jewel and MGW. Yeah, yeah. We're holding down the fort there yep. in doubles. Yeah. Jewel likes the team with the Greninjas. They're, they're a trio. Them. <laughs> um, yeah. That sounds like a good team. I, I like when... Uh, it's, the, it's, it's like it's a love triangle story, and Jewel's the, <laughs> Jewel's the girl in the situation. Oh, my God. Venya, Venya's the sexy vampire, and MGW is the sexy werewolf. Oh, my God. <laughs> <That's so cool. laughs> You're looking at me weird, Sage. 